The Gator men's basketball team takes another loss, falling 68-50 to to Alabama's Crimson Tide here at the O'Connell Center. Florida forced 14 turnovers in the first half, but in the second, Alabama came rolling out strong and had an 8-0 run and outscored Florida 41-17. Florida's head coach Mike White was at a loss for words after the game. With a porous defense, as Coach White says, they will continue to be average. I, I tell our guys uh, how bad we are defensively, and they look at me and say, yes, sir. That's the, kind of, that's the group I have, but it's not the answer I'm looking for. In the second half, the Crimson Tide had an 11-minute scoring run. Alabama shot 56% from the field, while the Gators only shot 33%. Coach White says they started off guarding good players, but the inability to do so for 40 minutes is a problem. But the, the defensive performance that, that uh, we just gave in the second half is very discouraging, to say the least. Um, I'm, very, I'm very surprised. Colin Sexton led all scorers with 17 points. Junior forward Dante Hall went 100% from the paint, shooting 7 for 7. And the Gators' offense made no response, shooting only 17 of 31 from the floor. And in all, only 5 of 24 from beyond the arc. After Alabama's win against number 23 Florida, the Crimson Tide are now 4 and 1 against ranked opponents, while Florida has now lost two consecutive conference games. The Gators will be back in action Wednesday to host LSU, who is currently 4-6 and six in the SEC, while the Gators are now 6-4. and four. For ESPN Gainesville, I'm Andrea Guerrero.